Pitbull, the entrepreneur, lets us get all up in his grill. Well, Mr. Worldwide has taken his music all over the globe, and now he's ready to take a South Florida institution all over the world as well. Time for some good food and full stomachs, SoFlo style. To Mr. Worldwide, all around the world. Hey. What do you get when you combine Pitbull, Mr. 305, with Miami Subs, a 305 staple? A rebranded restaurant with great food and a pretty cool business partner. Is it to make uh, Miami history, new Miami Subs history, and uh, show the world what you can do when two great brands run parallel, coincide, collide, come together. Miami Subs has been around for over two decades. And if you grew up in SoFlo, like Pitt, you grew up eating it. It's always been a part of my life. It's always been a part of Miami. The singer has branched out from music now to the restaurant biz. He joined the Miami Subs team as a partner and helped it become the new Miami Grill. And the first one in Florida is in Cutler Bay. Well, we teamed up with Mr. 305, Mr. Worldwide, uh, Armando Christian Perez. Everybody knows him as Pitbull. This wasn't just a business venture. He says he really does like the food. I mean, I remember sitting at the Miami Subs off of Lincoln Road in Washington, and when I would sit down there, I'd just sit and play with music, you know, write down lyrics, or any ideas that I had while I was eating you know, a 10 wing chicken platter or a gyro platter, those, those were always my favorite. Well, with Mr. 305 on board and a new name, it was time to add some Pitbull flair. When you come into a Miami grill, you hear Pitbull's music, you see the new design, and when you come in here, you feel like, welcome to Miami. Welcome to Mr. 305. He has influence on the menu. We have a Latin fusion menu. From cheesesteaks to gyros, wings to burgers, some things remain the same. We have some changes to the Miami Grill, but of course we kept some of the staples. But along with the Latin menu, they added some beer and wine. And if you eat in, they'll bring the food to you. Well, to me, it was good food at a, at a great price. And the good thing it was cooked right there, so you knew that you were getting you know, quality at least. Pitbull took his career worldwide, and now he wants to do the same for Miami Grill. Older Miami subs will get a makeover, and there are plans for new Miami grills to pop up all over. He, he sits on our board, he uh, gets involved with every detail and every business decision that Miami Grill makes, um, so we're proud to have him as our equity partner. Real fat, to let that die. Mm, we should have our own sub. What would be in it? <sighs> That's a tough question, Shereen. Cheese. Cheese, some veggies. Caviar. Caviar. With splash of champagne. Champagne tomatoes. Definitely. Oh, and tied with a, a luby like shoe tie. Yeah. To keep it all together. We'd make it pink and blue, though, for deco. Definitely. Mm. Ooh, the shoe tie. Pink and blue. Yeah. It'd be a number 10. Why? Oh, we're, yeah. Because we're hot. <laughs> Dust off the brain. Good night, everybody. Thanks for watching.